Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to be setting up a brand new Ledger Nano X. I chose the gold color because I already have uh, the previous model, the Nano S Plus in silver. I want to be able to quickly differentiate them. Plus, I find that the gold color looks pretty cool. The main difference between the Nano X and the Nano S Plus is that this one here offers Bluetooth and slightly more storage. However, the setup process is pretty much the same. So I'm going to start by unboxing it. Then I'm going to set up the Ledger Live software and then finally complete the configuration of the Ledger Nano X. Okay, so let's start by unboxing it. So it comes sealed. Open the box. Hmm, pretty cool. It has a little plastic cover on top. Let's see what else is in the box. Comes with the manual plus the cable. The next step is to go to ledger.com and download the Ledger Live software. So we're gonna go to ledger.com. Click on Apps and Services, and then click on Ledger Live. Select your operating system. In my case, it's Windows. I'm downloading it to the desktop. I have it right here. Going to start the install. The default location is fine. All right, and the Ledger Live is ready to go. To get started, we're gonna click on Get Started. Ledger is kind enough to provide us with an option whether we wanna accept or refuse sending them data analytics. I'm gonna kindly refuse. I'm gonna select Nano X and it's a new setup. This is some basic training. There's five screens. You can just click next, next, continue. Let's do this. The best way to get started, plan 30 minutes. All right, I'm ready. Turn on Nano. Okay, we're gonna turn it on now. Let's see. Okay, so let's start by setting up the pin. I'm going to click on, I understand that I must choose my pin code myself and keep it private. All right, set up pin code. So choose pin code and confirm. I'm going to do this on the ledger. I'm going to press on the right button, keep pressing until it says set up as new device. I'm going to simultaneously press both buttons. I'm going to select the pin. We're just going to take an easy one for this demo. Here you go. We only need to choose four, but you can go up to eight numbers. We're going to confirm it. All right, so it's time to write down the recovery phrase. You can either write it on a standard piece of paper or you can use the sheet that came with the Ledger Nano X. It's in the box with the manual. It looks like this. So I'm gonna, uh, let's see, we have to click next on the Ledger Live, get started. I understand that if someone gets my secret recovery phrase, my assets become vulnerable, yes. Okay, so time to write it down. And on the Ledger Nano X, you have to press both buttons. And then it's saying your device will generate 24 words. They are your recovery phrase. So I have to press on the right button. Again, write it down. Again, press both buttons to continue. I'm going to press both buttons now. Okay, so it did generate the 24 word seed phrase. 
So I'm gonna pause this video, write them down on a piece of paper and then continue. Okay, so as you can see, I'm done writing down the 24 word seed phrase. And now on the ledger, I have to press write and then double press so I can verify the words. Confirm your recovery phrase. All right, double press. Confirm word one. So I'm going to confirm the first word and I'm going to do this. Okay, so I'm done validating all 24 words seed phrase. Now I have to press right on the right button again and again. Press both buttons to continue. So oh. I'm going to press to continue. It's processing. It's initializing it. All right, so the device is ready. Go to dashboard. And now we're going to continue with the Ledger Live software just to continue finalizing the, the steps. So next, we did the recovery phrase. We're, we're going to hide it. And we're going to take the quiz. So as a Ledger user, my crypto is always stored on the blockchain, of course. If someone else gets access to my secret recovery phrase, my assets become vulnerable. When I connect my Ledger Nano to the Ledger Live app, my private key is still offline. All right. Next. Genuine check. Okay. So allow... It's, it's prompting us to allow Ledger Manager. So we're going to um, double press. Okay. So it's saying your Ledger Nano X is genuine and ready to use with Ledger Live. Continue. Going to close this here. And it looks like it's ready. Yep. Here we go. So the next step is to update the firmware. I can create a video for this as well. That's it. Your Ledger Nano X is officially set up. If the genuine check fails for you, you have to contact Ledger support. It means someone tampered with your device. You know, don't take a chance. Just contact them. Also, you still have to install apps and create accounts so you can send and receive coins. And for the update firmware, I will be covering that in a different video. Otherwise, this video will be too long. And just a reminder, never share your seed phrase or pin with anyone. The only reason I shared them on this video is for demonstration purposes only. And I will reset my ledger right after this. Welcome aboard.